Hi, my name is Ritika and I run Bartley company or as I like to call it Bartley Co. At the company we make unique upcycle products for home decor, one of them being the bottle lamp, which is what I'm going to be showing you today on how to paint on these bottles which are these old alcohol bottles. So what we need is an old alcohol bottle which you can find absolutely anywhere including your Adiwala. Uh we need paints. I have acrylic paints with me right here. We need a jar with some water that we can use to clean our brushes, a couple of paint brushes, a palette where we can mix our paint and LED lights that we will be putting into the bottle at the end. So I'm going to be making a Buddha, a little twist to the Buddha with white paint. I'm using a 4 point brush right now. Now we need to mix a little water. Now before you start on these bottles make sure that they're completely dry the surface does not have any grease so make sure that your hands have been cleaned as well uh in the bottle towards the center of the base is where we are going to paint the face first so now we're done with the face you don't need to put the entire paint on the entire brush over here you just need to tip the paint onto the tip of the brush so we're going to do that as you can see only the tip of the brush is coated with paint and then we're going to just make small circles around the head after doing the tip we're going to do the neck now the neck of buddha is slightly slender so we're going to make a thin but longish neck so we're done with the neck now a very crucial element of buddhism is the lotus so we're also going to add a lotus here at the base like the buddha is emerging out of the lotus Okay now next we have to get on with the detailing we are just going to take some black paint on because we need to make the eyebrows the nose and the eyes the lips using this we're going to start with the bindi right in the middle of the head between the two ears slightly above the two ears after the bindi the eyebrows both the sides need to look alike so be very careful again Next is the nose. Now the nose is going to come from the eyebrows, so it's going to go down, slant from here. Followed by the eyes. Now the eyes are shut, so you just need to make the design look like this. We're going to follow up the eyes with the lips now. Again, very crucial. We need to make him a little smiling. Okay so we're done with the black we're next going to take prussian blue and then outline the crown at the base over here fill in the color where you think it's going to there's going to be shadows with that we're done with the eye as well Now we'll move on to the neck. We are going to use the darker color over here. Just along the edges and then blend it in with the lighter. We will just quickly using the black paint make an outline just along the borders using the same thin brush. Now we're going to paint the lotus at the base in a different color. We're going to use red for that. Starting from the center of the lotus, we can take the brush strokes outward. On this red, we will just introduce the pink starting from the tip though. So 1 2 3 
as you can see this is adding more color to the lotus again we'll just define the petals using some more white paint some on the out outline Starting from the center, one, two, three, and that's it. Our Buddha is ready. So I'm going to be putting these LED warm white lights in the bottle. But before I do that, make sure that you let the paint dry for at least 24 hours to avoid any damage to it. Okay. Starting with this, you can start squeezing them in. Okay, we're almost done here with the lights. We're done. And this is how our Buddha looks with the lights in. This is how it looks from the back. And it's ready. Now you can keep this bottle anywhere in your house. You can keep this uh, uh, on a center table or you can keep it near a bookshelf and just put these lights around those books or you can keep it near your telephone or even in a garden. This will look actually really good in a garden around some uh, green plants. This will look fantastic in your house. Now you don't have to throw any of those old alcohol bottles out. You can just reuse them and make something fantastic out of them. Hope you enjoyed this and hope we make some too.